Alright, sorry for the delay in getting this episode out. Um, something happened with my computer and the game is crashing on my PC, so I have to go back to recording this on my phone. So it may not line up perfectly, but you know. Eh. Okay. Let's see. Let's go find out where those girls were hanging out. So it looks like we have Alice just standing out here by the tapioca. That's... Huh? Where did those two go? I spy Alice. And it looks like she's alone. Huh? But I thought the three of them left the school. Where did the other girls go? Anyway, let's try talking to her. Um, excuse me. What? If you give me your number, I'm just gonna give it back. Oh, wait, you guys are... Hello, hello, it's the Occult Club. Alice, what are you doing here all by yourself? Weren't you with the other girls? Well, that's what I thought. We did all come together to the shop here, but I wasn't paying attention and they left me. I don't have a phone either, so I have no clue where they went. Hmm. We wanted to ask you something, Alice. Like what? Well, about Kana, specifically? <laughs> huh? What? Why ask me? I, I had nothing to do with that. Nothing at all? But wasn't your group the one who bullied Kana? <laughs> Wait a minute. I told them they were going to kill her if they kept doing it. You can't compare me to those guys. I never did anything like that. And Inusagi started it. I was just hanging out around those two. Oh, really? Yeah, I couldn't go against those two. Couldn't go against? Yeah, those two are the leaders of the group. If I said anything against those twos, then I would have been their target. That's why there was nothing I could do. Jeez, that's why I've had to do everything they say this whole time. What? Nah, it's nothing. Anyway, those two started the bullying. And in that video when they said, this is my revenge against you, it was spot on. Even though I've gotten mixed up in this too. Um, Alice? What? <laughs> what the? Stop staring at me, you're creeping me out. I just noticed something behind you. Huh? Uh, what do you mean? There's an evil aura behind you. Tonight, the ghost will have her revenge against you. What, what are you saying? Don't say such a stupid thing. It's true. I can see the ghost behind you. Ha! Ah, don't look back. What? Now the ghost is hovering over your head. Ah! Oh my. She's quite a quick runner. Shiro, did you really see the ghost? Of course. I am the leader of the occult club. Don't even question it. Really? Oh, I can see his tail. He is lying. Shiro, you really shouldn't have pulled a joke like that. Your tail is so obvious. Huh? It was a joke? No, it was just a little fun. Those girls 
both will surely get what's coming to them. Shiro, what do you think you're doing stirring them up like that? Didn't we come to investigate? Sorry, I won't do it again. Jeez, I thought you were showing us a secret skill or something. But Alice's story, that Anne and Usagi are the main bullies, huh? Yeah, well, let's try talking to Anne next. Hmm? But she left Alice. Where could she have gone? Maybe she's somewhere close by? Well, let's click on this arrow and find out. There they are. Oh, isn't that Anne and Mikako? Seems to be. What the heck are they doing? Hey, hey, Anne. When we're done, can we go to that cat cafe? You really like cats, don't you? Um. Well, let me look and see if we have time now. G got it. Greetings, you two. Huh? You guys are... H hello The occult club? What are you doing here? Yeah, we just wanted to ask you something. Something to ask us? Speaking of that, Alice was looking for you two. But she might have already gone home. Oh, really now? So, is that everything? Huh? No, it's just Alice said she couldn't get in contact with you. Is there something else you guys want? Um... Jeez, what is it? Was that the reason you decided to bother us? No, no, sorry, we got a little sidetrack. We are looking into what happened to Asagi yesterday. Let us cut to the chase. And are you the one who brought Kana to kill herself? Huh? What? That's surprising. Sh Shiro, if you keep talking that way. I was one of the main bullies, but... You... Who told you this? Um, it was Alice. She told us everything in plain terms. That the originators of the bullying was Usagi and you. Damn her. And calm down. Oh, wait, Shiro. Maybe you shouldn't have told them that. Did I say something I shouldn't have? <laughs> that fatty. Just, what? Even though you heard that, don't believe anything she says. Alice is a huge liar. A liar? That girl, in order to protect herself, will tell a lie. Right, Mikako? Um, uh, yeah, that's right. Look, and that's why you shouldn't believe a single word she says. Really? Moreover, that girl also believed Kana. To say she wasn't involved is just a blatant lie. And she would spread rumor after rumor. Right, Mikako? Um... Yep, that's right. Just like Anne says. I thought these girls were friends with Alice. How could they say such a thing? Um, Mikako, what do you know about Sean? What do you know about Kana? M me Well, I, um... Hmm? You're not gonna tell us anything? Oh, the truth is... Hey, you have enough, don't you? Oh, are you trying to bewitch us or something? You guys are boring us with your talk. You're wasting our time. 
Sorry, we weren't trying to place a spell on you. No, but about that, you guys sure have a cold mentality. Huh? For Usagi to still be in the hospital? For none of you to offer to go see her, but instead come out here and play. That's... What of it? How is that related? Look, Mikako, we're leaving. Um... I said we're leaving. Oh, wait! And they left again. What the? Those girls. They really aren't friends at all. It's just a superficial friendship. Well, with those girls, there's no denying they could bully someone. By the way, it felt like Mikako wanted to tell us something. Back then, Anne stopped her. I wonder just what she wanted to tell us. <sighs> Mikako! Why did you come back alone? Wait, I, I have something to say. Something to say? Yeah. I... I... I never bullied Kana. Huh. You're saying you had nothing to do with the bullying, Mikako? Yes! I did see it all, though. But I didn't do anything. You just watched. Yeah! That's why this case has nothing to do with me. I even went to the teacher about Kana being bullied. I'm not involved at all. I see, I see. You came all this way back just to tell us that. Yes, but... We got it. Thank you. Thank you for understanding. Well, I gotta get back. But now I'm thinking. How can someone say they did nothing to be free from bullying? Huh? If all you did was watch, why didn't you help her? To say that is no different than throwing her away. Th that's... I thought you said you understood. If you had stood up to them, then Usagi and Anne wouldn't have been able to do anything. Those two must be terrifying. Yes. I was scared. To go against those two? We've always been so scared. Oh, wait! Mikako! She left. What the hell is with this group's image? How did Anne and Usagi terrify the other members in this way? It sure seems to be. Speaking of that, Kana's suicide is definitely linked to those girls bullying her. And there's no mistaking that this is all the work of Kana's ghost. Yeah. Well, what do we do now? Hmm, well, it's already late today. How about we pick up our investigation tomorrow? Sure. Well guys, we'll meet up again tomorrow. Alright, so that is the end of this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video, and I'll see you in the next part. See you later.